Hey guys, it's Bang for About PC Gaming here. Today I'll be bringing you some Shadow of the Tomb Raider gameplay and performance. All going to be played at 1920 by 1080 in DirectX 12 mode on a single RX 580 8GB graphics card. Everything is maxed out. So let's see how this card performs. Right off the bat, I have to say it's a very, very good looking game. Definitely a step up over the previous game, Rise of the Tomb Raider, which was a good looking game itself. But this is definitely taking things to another level. Operation Black has been initiated. None of the local workers leave the site alive. Okay, I gotta take this guy out. We plan for this. Best to probably maintain my stealth, so try and use melee or the bow and arrow, which is pretty much silent. Spectres are coming, be ready. Fuck. Ah, don't worry, I'll fix it. This is taking way too See if I'm gonna take these two out to with when he gets here, it's not a headshot. Damn, that guy's alerted his friends, but hopefully there isn't any more on the way. So yeah, I mean the graphics are just amazing on this game. Um, pretty demanding as well. The RX 580 is definitely one of the better 1080p cards on the market and I'm still struggling to maintain 60 frames per second. VRAM usage is pretty high as well, 5 gigabytes used. I'm only using SMAA as well. Alright, let's dispose of the bodies. You, monitor the police bay. Let us know when the gunshots get reported. Okay, so I'm gonna try and stab these guys up. And do this as quietly as possible, because if I alert these guys, it will just be four and one pretty quickly. Well, they found out tonight. Hope it was worth it. Yeah, asshole should have minded their own business. Sneak up on this guy. One down, three to go. I'd wish they'd uh, add a few more animations for the melee kills. I guess it all depends on which part of the body you sneak up on them from. Okay, so that's all these boys taken care of. Yes. Try and proceed now. Like I said, they've been dropped off. We'll move them deeper inside later tonight. Right. Stolfing's all fun, but let's see how it goes when you're all going loud with the guns. She's killing our people. Fuck. Copy that. Target sighted. The game isn't too CPU heavy as well. I'm only using around 30% of my i7 8700K. So. If you're playing with a quad core, it should be fine. Try and headshot as many of these guys as possible, save some ammo. The game does feel very, very smooth to play. It's, um,. Definitely a big improvement up on the Rise of the Tomb Raider's DirectX 12 performance, which was quite stuttery in places. And DirectX 12 is a clear improvement as well. Helps on the minimums, um, helps on the average frames per second as well, depending on where you are. And also, it's good to see that um, they've just built it from the ground up with DirectX 12 rather than shoehorning it in. Close-ups are amazing though, I have to say, one of the best looking games of 2018. Lara Croft. This isn't the way I hoped we'd meet. You know I've been interested in your work. Trinity always is.
The facial expressions have improved massively while in dialogue. The key of Shasha. I've sacrificed my life for this. Where's the silver box of Egypt? Give it to me. It's in a safe place. You don't have it. It never occurred to me that you would just take it. With this key and the silver box, we can remake the world without witness, cruelty. And certainly with none of this, but without the box, the apocalypse, the death of the sun. You're lying. Lara, you felt it when you took the key. Tremors are common. A tsunami is coming, and this is the first of many catastrophes you're doing. You would have done the same. I'm not too sure why Core 2 is pegged at 100%. It's very strange. The cleansing has begun. It falls to me now to stop it before it consumes us all. So it's about to get real now. Yeah. RX 580 doing a half decent job considering the game is maxed out, minus the, obviously the anti aliasing settings. It's doing a very, very good job at 1080p, hovering around the high 50s. So um, I've enjoyed the experience so far. Trying to find a way to get back up onto dry dry land. Where the hell did all this water just come from? It just came out of nowhere. the way you can proper swim on this game as well rather than before it was just like a quick submerge and, and then get back up but here you can proper free roam in terms of swimming and then you find like little pockets of air like this one here just to stay under the water longer man you gotta have to admit this game is so good looking especially for the close ups In terms of the character model, Lara seems a bit more beefed up. She's definitely a bit more thick this time. She's been doing them squats, I can see. So she looks a bit more capable, a bit more, I don't know, a bit stronger. Damn, it sucks. If we die like this, this is going to suck. Man. Break our way out of here. Got to find high ground. I'll give it to Lara, she can hold her breath for a long time. Here. So we 
ACC there's a lot going on. Core 2 stuck to 100%. I'm not too sure if anyone else has experienced this. But um, generally the usage is pretty low, around about 40% at the peak from what I've seen. to the top that was a great part of the game that was really really interesting in terms of the way they pace the game it's like fast paced slow paced and then out of nowhere there's just loads of action Okay, I, I promise. No, 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 no! We have to get to the hidden city before Trinity. We have to find the silver box. Okay, but first we're gonna help these people get to safety, and then we'll go after the box. No, no one is safe. Not if he gets the box first. I have to go. I'm the only one. You're the only one that can what? You don't know that you caused all this, Laura. Not everything is about you. These people need us here. We can do good now. Besides, what do we got to go on? A riddle? We're going to need more than pink fish and silver crowns to get to the hidden city. You can see motion captures come a long way. So is the voice acting. Brilliant stuff. I'm going to help these people. And then I'll find us a plane. So that's pretty much it for me guys hopefully you've enjoyed the video as always thanks for watching